been flying longer than sailing, that's for sure. I've been flying for nearly 50 years, but sailing only about... Uh, I started sailing when I was 54, so I was a late starter. Etchels, the reason I took up uh, sailing etchels was that a friend of mine was teaching me to sail and he had an etchels, so he started to teach me to helm an etchels. Initially started with, you know, just twilight races and then got on to more serious racing. And now I have fabulous crew who really do a wonderful, wonderful job, world-class crew. Savvy Jarvan and Sam Newton. And we have a fourth crew who's all of 11 years old and 30 kilograms, so he's, he does a great job hiking. Well, I have to say, so I was saying to the crew, really, if only we had another week of racing, we'd end up doing really, really well. Because it seems that every day we've improved. We'd, we didn't have a good start. Um, it started sort of mid-fleet and um, just gradually been coming up. I think we're running 14th at the moment. So there's hope yet to improve tomorrow. We shall see. Only one race though, which is a pity. <laughs> uh, no, we've done the best today, which is with the sea breeze. And so that was nice. And then tomorrow we pack the boat up and we, I'm going to trailer it back to Sydney. I, I brought it over uh, a week ago. And it's a beautiful adventure to, to drive all the way through Nalabar. Amazing roads, amazing, uh, just really nice people that you meet. Different little, little small towns. Great, great thing to do. I would recommend that anyone should do it. <laughs> The first race didn't go quite to plan. We didn't get off the start line very well. So it actually turned out to be our drop race so far. But we managed to take some learnings from that first start. Started well in the second race. Maybe not all the way to the favoured end, but had a nice lane and were able to boogie fast to the left side with the rest of the guys. We were overlapped with the other three guys around the top mark to be fourth. Did well down the run, picked up two boats and then uh, managed to grind our way into the lead up the beat and I think we extended down the last run to win the race. So it puts us in a pretty strong spot tomorrow. I, I think No Dramas has to finish second or better. So it's in his hands really. So we've just got to make sure we don't do anything really stupid and throw it away. I, I think on our boat, we enjoy the luxury of being brutally honest with each other and it's never taken personally. So. We're here to do the best we can and keep improving and we, we took some lessons, as I said, out of the first start and changed our strategy at the start line and started with a bigger, less congested area and it paid dividends. <laughs>